Mami, yo quiero verte, quiero ver porque te extraño. Porque te extraño. No me dice nada porque casi ya no hablamos. Ya no hablamos. ¿Dónde estás? Nah. Hablemos del pasado. del pasado. Solo quiero verte yeah. como cuando nos yeah. amamos. Hello, everybody. I know I have not posted in like a very long time, and it feels weird to be holding up the phone and filming. But you guys, the end of the year has came and a bitch need to start moving out. Currently right now it's Thursday of the week before I have to move out. I have to be moved out by Friday. Oh, there's people in the window. <laughs> I have to be moved out by Friday at 10 a.m. So I'm not going to have time to move out Friday. I think we're going to move out Thursday night and my dad's going to help us and stuff. But you guys, I literally have nothing packed nothing at all and i'm really really stressing out because i don't even have the time to be packing because it's gonna be finals week i really have to study for my accounting because your girl knows it but like i don't know it too well and it's gonna be an in-person exam so you know i actually have to know my stuff but you guys look at the room right now that's probably gonna be the first thing i pack y'all because i'm literally wearing the same things every day not gonna look cute for the next week you know it's gonna be pretty much me studying so i think we're gonna start taking that out not today though because i have accounting homework but just to start off this video and start this journey i want to film about it and just wanted to update you guys um there's a lot i need to catch you guys up on like a lot i'm definitely very sad but i don't have time to be sad today y'all i do not have time to be sad so I don't know. I don't know when I'll catch you guys up. Maybe tomorrow or Saturday on the weekend when I have more time. But it's such a beautiful day out. I'm going to miss this view. Looking at the church. That's actually where I take my accounting class. So I don't know if I'll miss it too, too much. But anyways, love you guys. Hey guys. So today is Monday and it's finals week. But it's also the last week we have to pack. So... Honestly, I have to be studying for my county finals. I don't know if I said that on the intro, but I think I'm going to just do that tonight. Study tonight and just pack with Sissy today. I don't think she wants herself shown on camera, so. What are you trying to say? Well, you look a mess. <laughs> so let me just show you guys what we're dealing with. I'm sorry if the energy is like running really low and like we don't look that excited. Who the fuck made Muga week the same as final week? Right, dude. Like I thought we were going to have like at least a three days after finals to move out but nope they said once you're done with finals pick up your shit and go home so that's exactly what we're gonna do yeah we put a lot of shit you guys and we only use like one fourth of it so anyways um i know look a mess y'all but just keep in mind that i've been going through a lot of stress but look how beautiful day it is outside and there's more mess that i have to figure out but anyways let me plug in my ring light and film this motherfucking time lapse. Let's do it, y'all. It's gonna be emotional, but we're gonna save the tears for later because right now we don't have time. Girl, I'm gone. Sissy, Sissy does not get one fuck that we're leaving. She's happy, but I'm not. Guys, I already started like under my bed, but honestly, I pack like two bags. On, well, at least I'm not gonna lie, I pack one, which is under all of that, and it looks like I haven't even touched the room, bro. Like, I already tackled my sleeping stuff because that's what the fuck I'm going to do when I get home. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just so over this room. Like, I, I loved it in here. But honestly, I'm so over it. This is where we ate. This is where we studied. This is where we went to class. This is where we did everything. So right now, I'm going to put my jeans away because honestly, I'm not wearing them. It's kind of warm outside. And a lot of the jeans don't fit me because your girl has been going up and down on weight like they'll fit one week but by next week they don't fit so i'm just gonna put these away and keep like maybe two pairs for class um i do have a class on thursday so i should plan yeah i have my final for accounting on thursday so i think i should plan on my outfit for that just so i don't have to be looking through the bags and being like where the fuck is my clothes is this shit stained permanently dude look here the top stuff i told you i bought but we have to be moved out by Friday and we have like all these rules or else we get charged. Like you have to clean your room, not leave a mess or else you get charged with a cleaning fee. And you also have to like turn in your keys and stuff or else you get charged with a fucking fee with materials. I don't what know do what to call it. They really acting like I'm gonna keep a key. Like y'all can have it back. 
Like, I can't even get in the fucking building. Sissy's gonna go home today. I'm not gonna go home today, but she's gonna go home and take some of the things home today. So, on Thursday, we only have, like, big things to take out, like, these things. We literally go home, and it feels like we have all our stuff there just because there's so much things at home. When you're about to sip it, like, sip it. Sip but, guys, I literally cannot believe this is the last week I'm gonna spend here. Like, I've spent the last... <laughs> 30 weeks we spent like the last eight months here and it just feels so sad to like let go of this room you guys like i'm gonna be in campus i'm gonna pass every day by this building in this room and it's gonna be where i lived but there's gonna be new people living here like it's just weird like that bathroom's not gonna be in my bathroom no more this room's not gonna be in my fucking room no more like it's just weird to think about it like that and it's weird that i'm gonna spend the last i mean the next three years here but each experience is gonna be so different i don't know maybe i'm just overthinking it y'all maybe i'm just too damn emotional but it's just weird <laughs> so it is organized girl look they're folded so these are all my jeans it actually holds a lot of stuff I empty this out and I empty most of this out. These are just like shirts and stuff, but I'm gonna put them in another bag. And I'm pretty sure I have like more shirts over here, so that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have, have more, I have more pants. Y'all, we are in bag number two. Uh, while I do this, I'm gonna make sure to separate it between clothes I want to sell on my spam account and clothes I want to keep. Just because a lot of this clothes is so cute, but like I know I won't wear it, so I'd rather just sell it and make some money out of it. Like, I would sell, like, 10 pieces of brand new clothing for, like, 50 bucks. So, each item is, like, so cheap. So, yeah, that's what I do. That's where I sell most of my stuff that I get from hauls and stuff. Just because I know other people can make better use of it. And, you know, yeah, I'm broke. I'm broke, too. But I feel like you guys deserve to have cute clothing for cheap. So, should I keep this or no? guys so this is the progress this is the bag we're gonna take home another bag we're gonna take home and that over there has clothes that sissy's gonna put in a bundle and over here sissy has to go over the sweaters that she's gonna take or she's gonna sell because honestly it's a lot of like sweaters that i don't feel like we need or even you so so yeah it honestly looks like we haven't done anything especially because all of this was under the bed so i don't know it's kind of like discouraging because honestly there's so much clothes and i know there's so much clothes back at home and there's no room for anything which is just like overwhelming because we don't know where we're gonna put all the stuff Next semester, me and Sissy are planning to move in early, but maybe not as early as we moved in this year. This year, Even though I do wish we did, just because I felt like it was really nice to have a whole week to set up the room, right? Without classes and shit. And by her timeline that she wants, we're only gonna have like three days. But y'all, your girl got a job for next semester. Probably won't talk about it much because I'll probably do it like a get ready with me later. But yeah, your girl got a job on campus next semester. You know, not gonna be making big bucks because it's only like five hours a fucking week. Oh, and I'm her boss. Yeah, and Sissy's my boss. <laughs> and that's so weird. <laughs> She's my boss and she'd be the main one trying to scream me over. Like, sis, what is this? Is so baby, so nice and much. Wait, I saw me. At least you don't have a final to be worrying about. I have a fucking final. 
Later that same evening. Okay guys, so we're back. We took a little break or whatever. It's so hot in here. We have like the AC pointing from the other room over here because it's so hot. Um, my roommate just left. But what we're going to do right now is take out all those pictures right there and try to put them somewhere where they don't like mess up or anything because we do want those pictures as memories. Um, I'm thinking of putting them in my diary, but Jennifer wants to put them in like a um, photo album or like our new room maybe. And since next year, me and Jennifer are going to have separate rooms. We don't know how we're going to separate everything. Sissy swears she's going to get half of it, but... And then we'll probably take off the posters right there as well. Anyways, we'll see what we get done today. If anything, we have tomorrow. Um, we're going to do laundry and probably going to go buy snacks later. We'll see what we do today. We're going to take you all in the adventure, so don't worry. But let's roll the most clean time lapse. The wall looks really empty now. Sissy's gonna get the laundry ready. She's just separating it. But meanwhile, she does that. I think I'm gonna take out the pictures that we also have right here for the desk, just so it decorates it and makes it look nicer. I'm gonna take those out and put those all away as well. Sissy already did the ones in this desk. Um, these are just a lot of things I have to do promos for, and it's so disorganized. But where did you put the pictures? Oh, they're right here. Okay. Guys, I'm sorry for the noise outside, but look, there's people taking graduation pictures. Like, that's gonna be us in three years. And honestly, I'm in a rush. I can't wait for that to be me. I can't wait for this four years to be over. Even though they said these are the four years about life. Bitch, you said that about high school. I would say they're probably so relieved, but my cousin honestly just graduated college too. And she's fucking stressed. So. so we're done with the posters and the pictures. It looks so weird because this is how it looked like when we first moved in. And then we had to cut the poster right there. Right now I'm going to take off those lights. They're honestly broken. So we're just going to throw them out because. Yeah, well, you're not be keeping the shit stacked. Or did you actually I'll just leave it right there? there. Are you going to put all the food there? Yeah. So right now Sissy's just wiping down and stuff because honestly we don't want to take dirty stuff because it's just going to be nasty when we see them again. And right now we have this basket full of decorations and it's basically what we did when we moved in which brings so much memories. <laughs> I don't know it's just reminiscing a lot you know. It's kind of making me sad like as I was packing my clothes I really didn't care I just wanted to get it over with but now that the decorations are leaving it's definitely really sad and now well basically i just started this clip because i'm gonna take that girl power thing off i am also gonna start putting my lashes away i wasn't sure if i wanted to put my makeup away just because i feel like i still want to take pictures like one last picture in front of my dorm room just so i can remember it but i feel like i could at least put away my eyelashes but honestly, I don't have time to take pictures, so that's probably not going to happen. So I'm just going to do the right thing and put my makeup away. Because deep down inside, I oh know this is not being used until I'm home again. And oh my god, is that person so annoying? I know they're just trying to do their job, but goddamn. So by the way, like as you guys can see, I have all of this makeup right here. These are just like a box of lashes. And then I have some makeup right there. My lip glosses. And I'm going to try to fit that all in there. I'm pretty sure it will fit just because it's such a deep basket. But I don't know how I'm going to organize it to be efficient, you know. Because it really depends how you organize this shit. If it's going to actually fit nicely or not. And I don't want things to be too hard to get. Because I don't want to do my makeup like... Pretty soon after I'm there, because what else am I gonna be doing at home? 
atrás Fue el día que me empecé a enamorar de ti, bebé De tus besos, de tus abrazos En el camino de mi vida he marcado tu paso Eres la única que me quiere cuando estoy hecho pedazo Te encontré justo cuando te estaba buscando Te encontré Y'all, I have so much shit that I brought that none of it fits, like, well, none of it fits, but, like, most of it does not fit inside that thing. When I came in to move in, all my makeup was in that basket, and now, like, I have all this stuff, and this stuff, and that stuff. But most of it, they kind of fit, but I just don't know where I'm going to put all that stuff yet. And I'm, like, really picky about where I put my makeup stuff and, like, my contacts and stuff, because people would just be messing up with my stuff. Sissy's over there trying to clear out her i'm not sure when you girl if only y'all could see her face she looks shitty as hell when she saw that i was pointing the camera at her but yeah she's getting that things from her dresser into that freca bag with just food in it and we have a lot of expired food y'all like we are not ready to be adults y'all because we be just having expired ass shit everywhere but anyways i think i'm gonna put away my contacts make sure they have enough contact solution because a lot of my contacts have dried out just because i have not been keeping up with them I think we're doing progress. We do need to take away this sticky stuff. Where is it? Where is it? Right there. Yeah. Tilly, I'm You're such a liar. That's not on my bed. That's the only thing that's gonna get you. Come here. Pass me a shoe. Ew! Sissy, pass me a shoe! Any? Yeah. What is it? It's a spider. It's a spider? Yeah. Is it? No, it's actually it's an actual spider. Come on, hurry up. I'm scared. Hurry up, but I still have the balls. No. I feel bad to see. It's just a spider. Where is this spider? It's a spider. Ah. You missed it. It's. it's I don't want to kill it. It's too hard. Oh, stop. You make me feel bad. Ew, something came out of it. Ew. Eventually. So, this is the progress right now. The closets are like not even empty, bro. Um, I'm gonna keep the tank tops in there just because it'll be really easy to transport them. But you guys, we still have those clothes to hang up. We're probably gonna do the same bag strategy. And then I just have my winter boots over there that I definitely wanna keep. I know they're like really old and stuff, but maybe next winter I won't have enough money to buy new ones, so they're good enough. Jennifer's snacky snacky drawer what? is. Don't have it because you like it. Well, you're the only one that freaking ate from here. Oh, really? Yes. No. Her snacky snackies are empty. Um, she still has a lot of clothes in that drawer. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I ate from here too, guys. Don't worry. <laughs> so I still need to take that one out. But it's like, oh, damn, my phone almost fell on my face. But that one's like really hard to take out. So I'm going to wait a little bit. But y'all, I took off the monograms. Like these I things. And I flipped them, and I don't remember if that's paint and if it looked like this or if it's this is mold. My older sister said it's mold, so no, it's yeah. Mold. We should take that one off and see if it has paint also. Um, as you guys can see, this is the progress. I feel like the most progress we've done is in that desk. Really? Yeah, look at it. It's almost empty. Like there's nothing in this drawer or anything. <laughs> so right now we're gonna throw away all the trash i feel like i'll make the room look a little better because right now it's really dirty y'all that whole big bag is just trash okay guys so right now we're checking if the um monogram i was gonna say ottoman is the monogram actually god i do not remember guys <laughs> we just have so much <laughs> open it we're trying to do laundry now and just somebody else you saw somebody else There's somebody else being done their stuff so we gotta win them Yeah, so we couldn't beat them. It's like really loud in here. I don't know if you guys could hear me, but as you guys could see, they used to. And then they were trying to use this one, but as y'all could see, it was out of order. So me and Jennifer were in an awkward position as if we didn't have to give up our only laundry or if to, you know, just let them, I mean, let them figure it out. But we just let them figure it out. We're going to try to do at least some laundry. Um, we definitely always try to use two, sometimes we use three, but these are so small, y'all. Like, they barely hold any clothes. 
Do you just wanna wait? It stinks, dude. Like, did that clothes smell that bad? Yeah. Really? Maybe it doesn't wash right. I think maybe we should wait, no? I'd rather wait. So, a little update if you guys didn't understand what I was trying to say is me and Jennifer were trying to rush down here because we saw somebody else needing to do laundry. So, we were just like, it's fine, we'll rush over there, we'll get there before them, we'll get to the laundry. But nope, they got there before us and they had like a shit ton of clothes, dude. They used like three laundries, but in reality, they needed like all four of them, if not five. So, we ended up lucky enough to put one so we were like okay fine at least we could do some laundry but that shit stank dude like i don't know if the if the washer is bad and it just doesn't wash clothes or if that's clothes stunk that bad that it stunk up the washer but we just took our out oh, really? <laughs> and brought that shit back and we just put a timer so hopefully we can get their washing machines as soon as they're done but then as we were going up, there's other uh, two dudes were gonna do laundry, and we told them like there's none, but like, you can use this one, but it stinks, and they just left. So I don't know if they're also gonna try to come they back in 30 so minutes. So right now we're wiping down these things. This is Jennifer's sterilized drawers. She has them in gray, but I have mine in pink over there. But we're just gonna put the rest of those things in here, and probably the hair tools, because I don't think we're gonna be doing our hair most definitely. So I think we're just gonna try to fill those out um i don't know maybe try to clean those but i'm really disgusted y'all like i cannot and the rest will be like a lot of little shit like i also have to put away those things but i don't know it's looking pretty okay i think we did a lot more progress than we thought we would but it still looks like no progress but i promise we did <laughs> Okay, y'all, so we're going downstairs and we're gonna finally put in our clothes. We have to hurry though because they never went to go get their clothes, so we put it in the dryer for them. Yeah, so this is what the room looks like. I think we're gonna stop for today. Jennifer's gonna go home today, take most of these things, and then the rest of the things we will just take out. And I feel like we don't have that much left once all this is gone. I feel like it's gonna look much more emptier, but for the rest of the things, we are gonna need a U Haul. So we're gonna go switch our clothes into the dryer, but I think we're done for today. We got a lot of stuff done, like we're finally. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're finally seeing the progress. Yay! Oh yeah, but I'm probably not gonna film till like Wednesday or Thursday. Thursday is the day my dad comes, so that's when you guys are gonna be able to see the things actually being taken out of the room and oh, seeing the room. Yeah, and you guys are gonna. Oh yeah, that's true. You guys are also gonna see the room like empty, empty. So that's exciting. That's something I want to keep for myself, like a memory. And I don't know, you guys. I'm getting really emotional, but it feels like. I'm really excited at the same time and like everything's happening so fast. So I don't know, it still stays bro. Like Hi guys, so I don't know why I'm whispering but it's just kinda awkward because I had to turn off the air. But this is the progress that we have in the room. Honestly, there's still so much to pack and like I didn't unpack anything when I was at home, so I was only able to bring two blue bags because there's literally no space and there's still so much to pack but i think right now i'm gonna just focus on doing the bed i wish i would have like washed my sheets and the bed skirt before putting it away and honestly if i wanted to i could i don't know if i should should i i don't know it's gonna take so long it's gonna take so much time i probably won't but yeah this is what we have right now um i was gonna put the bed away i mean not the bed <laughs> imagine i was gonna put the sheets away and everything but now i kind of want to clean them um my dad also told me to unplug the bridge so i'm gonna do that like in a few hours i'm gonna probably just hang out my shirts and i'll probably like take everything out of the drawers so i know how much things are left and nothing gets forgotten so 
so yeah that's the plan for today okay guys just to check in um i did end up washing the sheets and the comforters and the blankets same as here i did wash hers and i don't want to say i'm so glad we kept like where the bathroom came from and the sheets because it honestly helps so much in putting things away and keeping things organized so yeah this is my progress i still have so much to do and i feel like it just keeps looking messier and messier but it's definitely getting empty there's nothing in those drawers or those drawers or those there's nothing in that there's nothing in those so i'm gonna like collapse them i'm just not sure if i need them right now i didn't i do need to get those shirts in a bag i need to get that ready i ended up washing the bathroom trash can and putting things in it same as that one but not a lot of things are fitting in it um i would say like i don't know i we did put things in here before moving in and i didn't really care because it was clean and even though i cleaned it like i didn't just take shit out and then i didn't just put, take the i didn't just put things in without washing it. i did wash it but just knowing that we used it for the bathroom <laughs> So I'm like ew but like, I did wash it and I put Clorox wipe I wiped it out with Clorox and everything so it's just it's just like you know a mental thing so I do I don't not sure what I need to do even though there's a lot to do but I'll figure it out and yeah I don't know it's just so overwhelming we have so much stuff I'm like I don't know where we're gonna put all of this at home I feel like we said that so many times already Good morning, guys. I'm back home now, and I'm sorry I didn't move. I didn't film any of the moving process, y'all. Like I didn't film anything. I didn't film my parents. Um, I mean, just my dad and like my brother and like his friend helping, just because I was a little bit awkward and it was really hectic, y'all. Like we were supposed to turn in our keys, and we didn't even turn in our keys. So now we have to go back to college and do that. And our college is not that far, but like it's not that close either. Where it's like a really quick trip. So that sucks, and I'm sorry I didn't film that. I'm really upset at myself. I didn't even get one last video of, like, the whole room by itself, so I'm upset. But I did get pictures, so I will put those pictures up right now or beforehand. I don't know. We'll see what Emily, what editing Emily wants to do. I'm back home the mess is all here all my shit is right here y'all and it's a mess like we don't even have space in our house to put all this stuff in so we had to figure it out but I am happy to be back home with my cats I already know I love my babies but I am sad I'm so relaxed already like I'm already so relaxed from school work like I don't feel overwhelmed anymore I feel at peace right now I'm gonna go out with Jennifer to do her hair I'm gonna film that for you guys but I just wanted to show you guys the little situation we have on like this is just our little room this is my filming room I don't know if you guys remembered it but it's not that much of a mess y'all but like further back into the house it gets messier we have this right here then we have two bags right there and then we have another cat right there just cats everywhere and the cats are so happy about seeing like all the bags and stuff not because they're happy to see us but because they're happy to play with it but as long as they're happy i don't give a fuck but berlin is so cute y'all i think today i have enough energy to go through it and to actually make this place a little bit more comfortable and livable and just cuter you know because i want to film in here and do my makeup in here and just you know have this as my filming room just like i had it um we do have this biggest cat tree now that my friend gifted to us so that's also gonna get in the way a little bit but i think it'll be fine no i'm filming a video but anyways this movie need series will have to go on a few days um i really wanted to upload it today maybe or tomorrow as, as soon as i edit it but, but i think it would be, be a little fun if i just film us organizing some stuff here just so you guys can see my house and like the cats and stuff so anyways i have to go now so i decided that i'm gonna film a part two to this video so if you want to see me and jennifer organize at home and like settle in and stuff and just try to make stuff work come back for part two because this video is too long it's already 30 minutes so please if you guys like this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe let me know down below what other videos you guys want from me and just you know show your support show your love because i love it 
and i'll catch you up with your faces in the next video thank you so much for watching and for joining me and jennifer in this journey that has ended you know like it's so crazy to think that i wanted to make this an emotionalized video like i was gonna sit down and talk about my gear and i was gonna sit down and talk about how crazy it has been but y'all life is moving too fast i don't even have time to process it so honestly i'll probably do that in part two because i am sad but anyways don't forget to like comment subscribe i'll catch you up your faces in the next video